Welcome. My name is Robert Rowling. I'm an associate professor in the Department of Electrical and Computer Engineering at the University of British Columbia. I'm the founder of the Biomedical Engineering option within the Electrical Engineering program. The question I get most often to start is, what is biomedical engineering? Biomedical engineering is a multidisciplinary field that combines engineering with medicine and the life sciences. Programs differ depending on the biomedical engineering option or degree program offered at different universities. At UBC, in our biomedical engineering option and electrical engineering, we look at electrical engineering solutions for diagnostic systems, for therapeutic systems, monitoring systems, drug delivery systems, and other electrical engineering solutions to help improve patient care. The biomedical engineering option was founded in 2006. The option was founded in response to demand from faculty and from students and employers to help improve training in the area of biomedical engineering. The purpose of the option is to give students skills in biomedical engineering and expose them to applications in medicine and the life sciences. It should be emphasized that students in the biomedical engineering option receive training in the same key fundamental areas of electrical engineering as students in the regular electrical engineering degree program. The difference with the biomedical engineering option is that we take out a few courses in electrical engineering and replace them with specialized courses in biomedical engineering. The idea is that the same skills in electrical engineering can be taught with biomedical engineering applications. Some of the laboratories, design projects, and technical electives are also customized for biomedical engineering. The biomedical engineering option is a three-year option. It begins in year two, so we select students from the first year of applied science. One of the reasons the biomedical engineering option begins in second year is our desire to give students some unique training in biomedical engineering that will give them skills that will make them attractive to employers during their work experiences. When you enter the biomedical engineering option second year, you will have a choice. You can take either the project integrated program called PIP or the lecture integrated program called LIP. Both of these streams are customized for the biomedical engineering option. If you have an interest in applying for the biomedical engineering option, I encourage you to visit our website. The website not only includes the application forms for admission into the option, but also contains information and links about biomedical engineering in general. The deadline for application is March 31st of each year. We do accept applications after this deadline and will consider students as long as there is space still available in the program. We also encourage transfer students to apply for the biomedical engineering option. I understand some transfer students may not be able to meet the March 31st deadline. In this case, we keep a few positions available for transfer students, so I simply encourage you to apply at the earliest possible date. The reason for the early deadline is to give students an indication of whether they've been accepted into the biomedical engineering option before they need to make the final decision of which department to choose. Of course, if you are accepted in the biomedical engineering option, you need to select electrical engineering. After you've received your acceptance into electrical engineering, you will receive your final acceptance into the biomedical engineering option. Thank you for listening so far, and good luck with your applications, and I look forward to seeing many of you in the option.